Local 10 is speaking with the girlfriend of the hero who tried to stop an attack on a woman at a Lauderdale Lakes Walmart and was shot and killed. Meanwhile, the suspect who worked at that store faced a judge today. Local 10 Sonella Savovic is live with our exclusive interview. Sonella. Thierry Bastien was inside this Lauderdale Lakes Walmart when he saw a man beating up a woman. He raced in to help her out. He was killed for doing that right in front of his own family. Their lives have forever been changed now. This infant baby boy will now never get to know who his father was. It's the sounds that plays back in your head. It's the whole scene that plays back in your head. It was supposed to be a simple shopping trip that changed Makia Ford's life forever. She watched her boyfriend, an infant baby's father, Thierry Bastien, get shot six times. In the front of the baby and in the front of my kids and in the front of me, that's something I'm never, ever going to get over for the rest of my life. Ford says she and Bastien witnessed a man beating up a woman inside this Lauderdale Lakes Walmart. No one tried to help the woman out, and Ford says Bastien came to her aid. When he threw her down and he started punching on her is when he ran off to go help her, and I pulled him back and I told him to don't go, and he said he'd just go in to help. Bastien and the alleged shooter, a Walmart employee who was off the clock, Tyrone Sterling tussled. An investigator say Sterling shot him. Ford pleading with the shooter after the first shot to spare her boyfriend's life. I had the baby in my hand. I was like, no, please, even it's for the baby, even it's for the baby. And he just stood over him and he just shot him. Sterling was arrested Tuesday night and appeared in bond court today where he was denied bond. Sir, you're charged with murder while engaging in certain felony offense. For Ford, it won't bring the love of her life back, who she says mm. was an amazing father. He was really all about his family working and taking care of his family. And you just took that away from us. And that's not fair. It's not fair to the kids. And it's not fair to me having a big heart that he have. He went down as a hero, but it's sad. Sad indeed, and he did go down as a hero. The family has established a GoFundMe link to help pay for funeral expenses. If you'd like to assist, you can find all of that information on our website, local10.com. For now, that's the very latest here out of Lauderdale Lakes. Sonella Sabovic, Local 10 News. It is just so heartbreaking. Okay, thanks a lot.